Aishwarya, your biology and SST expert. I'm Saurabh, your physics expert. And we welcome you to this edition of Baiju's Quiz Masters. So, we have had Baiju's Quiz Masters session before, but this time it's different. We have got thousands of entries and from those thousands of entries, we have selected two amazing candidates to join us here on this stage of Baiju's Quiz Masters. I know you are very eager to meet them. We will meet all of them. Don't worry. Look at your four sides. It's so different this time, right ma'am? Yes, we are at the Baiju studio and as you can see around us, right? We see this beautiful set. So can we quickly show it to our wonderful live audience what we have with us today? Yes, we promised you. Bigger, better and grander and that's exactly what we have today. So we have a team that has worked relentlessly to make sure that we bring this amazing show for all of you. So please make sure that you show your love to them by telling them how much you love what you see on the chat right now. And of course, sir, I'm sure they must be excited, right? Yes. Show your excitement. Come on, come on. Kya kar rahe yaar? Chat flood kar do abhi. Come on, do it right now. Yes. So, of course, everybody, in the meanwhile, as you are letting us know how much you are loving this, please make sure that you like this video, right? Because all of this is for all of you. Make sure that you share this with your friends because, sir, what we have for them is amazing today, right? Yes. Look, expectations are all but I know this time you have huge expectations and don't worry, we'll deliver, we'll deliver, but you also, come on. Call your friends, bring everyone in, come on, come on, flood the chat, show us the excitement because here, this is the time to celebrate and this is the time for you to be involved, come on. Yes, and of course we see that a good number of you are already here and we need more and more of you in this particular show. Yes, yeah, so do not forget to subscribe and of course sir, I think we have a yes, lot right Yes, come on, today. we have only 135 live right now, come on guys. Bug up, bug up, join. All right, so we, this time is different. Yes. We already told this to you. All right. And are you excited? There's a poll. You can answer that poll to show your excitement. Come on, do it. All right. So, ma'am, we told them. Very different yeah. to hair. Yeah. Na? This time is different. But how exactly? Apart from this big screen, this grand studio, what's different? Well, whenever we talk about quiz masters, they know it's a quiz. That means that there are going to be questions and there are going to be answers. Yes. So, sir, when you get an answer correctly, right? How would you ah, feel? A correct answer makes me feel happy. It makes me feel, ah, yes, we won. So, when our contestants get their answers right, it would go something like this. Ooh, <sighs> nice. That looks amazing. <laughs> All right. So this was about right answer. But what happens when we give a wrong answer? So if I get a wrong answer, I would feel a little low, right? I'm like, Are, I knew the answer to that, but I made some silly mistake. But nonetheless, I'll not get demotivated. I'll push myself to be better. Yes. So yeah, I'll tell you what a wrong answer feels like on this set. A wrong answer feels like this. It's okay, it's okay. It means we can do better and will do better, right? This was just a small glimpse of what we have in store for you today. Chota se trailer tha ye. Picture bhi baki hai, dost. Yes, and so we're seeing a lot of them saying that they're loving the set, they're yes. loving the whole thing. So everybody, if you are loving it, shout out to the team who has made this happen, right? Very good. Thank you, Gun Gun. Thank you for the thank you for this comment. And 96% said they like this kind of a set. Huh? Very good. Yes. All right, kids. Let's start, right? What do you say? Yes, I'm sure they must all be eager to meet who amongst their friends were lucky to actually come be a part of today's edition of Quiz Masters. Some of you might be knowing, hai na? <coughs> Internal form is all about it. You also might be knowing who is coming, right? Right? You have seen the post, hai na? Don't worry. Let's call your friends on stage. And the first contestant, the first contestant we have is Gagna from class sixth. Hello, Gagna. Hello, ma'am. How are you, Gagna? Fine, sir. What do you feel in this awesome seat? Awesome being here. 
it's one of my dreams <laughs> oh we are equally delighted to have you i'm telling you all right gagna so all your friends are waving at you right now virtually of course you can wave them back tell them hi you are a celebrity now <laughs> <laughs> all right so can you tell everyone uh your hobbies what do you like your school just a brief introduction i'm gagna i study in 6th i'm from wales global school I love to uh, dance. I love to sing. I love to paint, and I love playing badminton. Wow! Brilliant, huh? Nice. So we have an amazing all-rounder with us. So welcome, Gagna. I hope you're excited today. And even uh, I want to be an astronaut when I grow up. Wow! Nice. <laughs> we have done sessions for you, huh? Okay. Yes. Yes. All so right. that is our first contestant for today. Now let's meet our next contestant. We have Hansik Sham from Class A. Woo! Hi everybody. Hi Hansik. How are you? I'm very good, ma'am. Are you Thank excited? You. Yes, ma'am, very much. Yes. Okay. So shall, shall, can you quickly introduce yourself to all our amazing friends who are out there and tell a little bit about yourself? Yes, ma'am. Uh, Siksham, I study in uh, eighth standard. I'm from National Public School. Uh, I like to do new things. I like to explore things, and uh, I like to visit places. Uh, I love football, sports, and uh, I love to. Great life watching, right? That's our aim. That's our target, and we are going to try to achieve it together. Yes. All right. So, Hansa, sorry, uh, Gagna and Hansik, shall we tell you the rules of Quizmaster? Yes, sir. All right. See, we have six rounds in total. The first five rounds will have two questions each, and one question for each of you. <laughs> If let's say you give a wrong answer, the question will be passed on to the other contestant, and each question will give you one point. Okay. Fine. All right. Is this clear till now? Yes, okay. sir. Each question will have thirty seconds. But I just said six rounds, and I told you about five rounds. Man, what does it mean? That means there's going to be a sixth round, a super interesting round, and all you need to do is to stay tuned for round six, right? Yes. And it's going to be exciting. So we we'll tell you about round six when we get to round six. So round six okay. is a surprise, okay? It's a surprise. Fine. To all of us. <laughs> all right. <laughs> okay. So shall we start, guys? Come on, tell us right now. Are you ready? Are you guys ready? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Some All right. Some more energy. Are we ready? Yes, yes. ma'am. Hello, okay. Josh. Hi. Yes. That's something we we should tell our nine ten students. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Round one. All right. This round we are calling the shootout round. Okay. Now this round is a multiple choice question based round, which means two questions. There will be multiple choice questions. Okay. Now first. Hmm. Who wants to go first? Me. All right. Yes. yes. Obviously, class class six will will uh, give you the first question. Okay. So, Gagna, first question I'll give you, and guys, you in the chat, you can also participate in this question because we'll have a YouTube poll for you. Okay. Fine. Yes. So we'll see who gives the correct answer, you or Gagna. All right. Okay. ठीक है. First question we'll have for you. Are you ready? Yes, sir. Okay. First question. On the screen now. All right. The first question is: Which instrument can be used for observing an object over an obstacle that prevents direct line of sight vision from the current position? Okay. Can you see the question? Yes, sir. Yes, na. All right. We have four options: telescope, microscope, periscope, or kaleidoscope. All right. You are at the question. Shall I start the timer? Yes, sir. Okay. Your time starts now. Sir, I want to answer. You want to answer? Yes, sir. Yeah, you can answer. Uh, it's option C, periscope. All right. So you're saying option C, periscope. <coughs> Feeling confident, huh? Yes, sir. All right. Gagna took less than ten seconds to get to yes. the answer. Yes. Guys, what about you? What are you waiting for? When will you answer? Come on, answer right now. Okay. All right. So let's lock periscope. Sure. Yes, sir. All right. Let's lock periscope. Okay. All right. All right. So then let's see how your friends did. All right. In YouTube, sixty-three percent people got it correct. That means sixty-three percent of them agree with you, Gagana, that they think it should be option C. 
Yes, you are right. It's a correct answer. Very good. Well yes. done, Gagana. Well done. Thank you, ma'am. Thank right? you. Sir. In periscope, we all know submarines use it, right? Yes, Anna? sir. Because they are underwater, they want to see something which is over the water. So they have two mirrors, which are 45 degrees, reflection happens. Very good, I know, you knew this. You also understand this, no? Yes, periscope was the correct answer. Fine. Ma'am, next question, shall we yes. move? Yes, so shall we move on to the next question? And this will be for Hansik. Yes, ma'am. So Hansik, are we ready? Yes, ma'am. Now we know, right, what we can expect from this round. Hmm. Yes? Okay, so can we have the question on screen for Hansik? Okay, which of the following vaccine is given to a newborn? Is it HPV vaccine, COVID vaccine, BCG vaccine or tetanus vaccine? So, shall we start the timer? Yes, ma'am. Your time starts now. And everyone in the chat, I hope you are answering as well. The poll is out for all of you also. Ma'am, it's option C, BCG vaccine. Option C, BCG vaccine. Yes. So shall we lock it? Yes. Hundred percent. Yes. Pakka? Full confidence, yes. huh? Very good. Okay. So shall we go ahead and lock option C, BCG vaccine? Yes. So shall we see how what our friends in the live chat think? Yes. What about those of you in the live chat? Do you all agree with Hansik? Do you think that it's BCG vaccine? Well, we see that 45% of them agree with you. Okay. And well, you know what, Hansik? You are right. The correct answer here is BCG vaccine. Well done. So we know BCG vaccine is given in the first few days after yes. the infant is born, right? And we know that BCG stands for. You know what BCG stands for? Yes. Will you tell me? Uh, Ma'am, it's uh, basically given for tuberculosis. Yes, very good. So it's given for tu uh, tuberculosis and stands for Bacillus Calmet Guerin. Okay, very good. Very good. So can we have the scorecard, please, after round one? Wow, brilliant. Both of you, Gagna and Hansik, you are on one one point each because you both gave the correct answer. Well done. Feeling good yes, now? Yes. Now yes, the warm up is done. <laughs> now we can just play the real match. All right, all right. <laughs> Oh, nice. Very good, Polkit. Very good. Guys, we know. Yes, you are also playing very brilliantly, Anna. Nice. All right. Shall we move to round two now? Yes. yes. yes sir. But sir, before we go into round two, we have something very important to tell our students out there, yes. right? Yes. So, I think we all love what we do over here, right? Similar kind of thing we are doing for you on 4th of December. It's a webinar, right ma'am? Yeah, so we are having a webinar which is going to happen on at 12.30 p.m. on the 4th of December. And we are going to be understanding why we should learn science the experiential way. What is experiential, first of all, we all think, right? It's not just about experiments or doing lab experiments or something else, but it's about a way of learning, right? So this is something you will get to know. Make sure all of you register for it. The link is in the description. It's very important, right? Yes. Okay. So we have a poll as well, right? So we do have a poll. So please do make sure that you do register for the webinar in case if you haven't. And of course, I, I know that both of you love science and you love visualizing yes. it, right? Yes, so our friends here also love visualizing and we know you love it. So now let's understand why that is important and do more. If Saurabh sir and I tell everything now, then you know there will not be much left for fourth, right? <laughs> yeah. So make sure you register, it's very important. And don't worry, it's a webinar. So we'll face like, you know, face to face to each other. Don't worry, come on, register right now. Okay, so with this, we are going to move on to the next round. That is round two for all of you. So now round two, right? Before I tell you what is round two, do you both love riddles? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma you like riddles? Kind of. Okay. So this round is going to be a riddle round. All right. Okay. And we'll be giving you some riddles mm -hmm. and you have to try to identify what is the science that it is trying to say or what is the instrument or if it's going to be a scientist. Well, that's up for you guys to figure out, right? Yes, and again, we will have 30 seconds to answer this question and the question will come on your screens. Yes? Yes. Two riddles, one for okay. each. Yes. So now this first riddle is going to be for Gagana. So Gagana, are we ready? Yes, ma'am. Okay, let's bring that excitement in and can we have the question on screen, please? Yes. I act as headphones to listen to the rhythm of the heart. So can we have the time starting now, please? Ma'am, I know the answer. 
Okay. You know the answer. You know the answer. Very good. Why don't you tell us, Gagana? What is this? It's set stethoscope. Stethoscope. Okay. So can you tell me why you think it's stethoscope? Because the doctors use it as an instrument to listen to a heartbeat. Okay then. What about all of you in the chat? Do you also agree with Gagana? Do you think it's stethoscope? Very quickly, let us know, right? If you say yes, then go ahead and say yes, 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 yes. so that we can go ahead and see if Gagana is correct. You go to a doctor. <sighs> Take a deep breath. <gasps> right? <laughs> yes. So with this, all of Zara has revealed the answer, and that is the correct answer. Well done, Gagana. Well done. It is that the scope, and like you mentioned, it's the instrument that we use, right? The doctors use especially to check the rhythm or the heart beat that is there. And you know, um, a lot of people know. Oh, you also know about this, no? In physics, we have the same thing for multiple reflections of sound, right? Hmm. Sound travels with multiple reflections, then reach your ears. They go by science is always together. As any other physics, chemistry, bio, they yeah. just walk separate ways. It's all hmm. science combined, right? You all know this. All right. So first riddle done. Now we have the next riddle for Hansik. Ready, Hansik? Yes. Okay. Okay. Let's have the riddle on screen. <laughs> I can make cheap jewelry look expensive, lustrous, and attractive with the help of electricity. Ooh! Shall we start timer? Yes, timer is started now. It's electroplating. All right, Electro electroplating. Okay. Fine. Confident about this? Yes. Very good. I like your confidence. <laughs> huh? Very good. All right. Let's stop the timer. Yes, guys. What do you think? It's Hansik right now. Huh? If you agree with Hansik, you know what to do, no? In the chat, should go yes, 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 yes. That's what we are looking for. Yes, come on, I can see your answers. Come on, come on, come on. Very good. All of you are seeing electroplating. Very good. And yes, that's the right answer. Electroplating. <laughs> well done, Hansik. Well done. Yes, that's true. Electroplating. See, electricity and plating. Plating is like covering. Electroplating is using electricity. So anode may we put the metal, right? Yes. With which you want to plate. And mm -hmm. cathode may you put the metal which you want to get plated. Right, nice. So, riddle is something you both aced really well, huh? <laughs> yeah, they are acing all the rounds. They're like, nice. all of these questions are at the tip of my fingers. So very quickly, can we have the scoreboard, please? After round two. Whoa! It's, it's a tie again. Yeah. Very good. Very good, guys. Well, well played, huh? All right. Shall we go to the next round now? Yes, sir. Hey, na? Hmm. Now yes, sir. you guys are pro, huh? Already. <laughs> Chalo. All right. So round three for you. Now round three is a visual round. All right. Which means we'll show you. A video, a picture, something, and then ask question based on those visuals. Okay, guys, for you also. Fine. Is this is this thing clear to you? We'll show you a visual, then ask a question based on that visual. All right. Ready? Yes, and the sir. visual will be there on the screen for you. All right, guys, and for you will be here. Okay. Chalo. Let's have the first visual on your screen. Whoa. Kagana, this seems familiar, no? Yes, sir. Oh, nice. Are you are you clear with this visual? Just have it in your mind. <coughs> okay. You have seen it clearly? Yes, sir. It's okay. I have not told you the question. It's just the visual. Hey, na? I think you saw you saw what? Uh what was that? A bat, huh? A bat and a butterfly. Oh, nice. All right, now I'll ask you a question. Okay. All right, let's have the question on screen. Which waves are produced by bats in the video shown? Is the question clear to you? Yes, sir. All right, your time starts now. It's okay. You can take turns if you if you feel two three answers. What do you think? What the bat was doing? They were sending something and something was coming back. Which waves were those? Uh, sir, uh, it, is it sound waves? Uh huh. Uh huh. Yes. Mm. Are you you are right? You are in the right direction for sure. Can you think of maybe mm. what kind of waves in that? 
I don't know, ma'am. I know sound waves. It's okay. It's okay. All right. Hansik, do you want to take this question? I'll try. Okay. All right. So, what's your answer? Uh, is it favorite? No. All right. So, this question, I'll tell you. The correct answer is ultrasonic waves. Oh. Okay. Ultrasound, you guys know, right? Yes. Hana? Huh. Same thing. So, that's why I was pushing you. Sound <laughs> is correct, but what type of sound? So, bats use echolocation. Hana? We did one session on this. Yes. They use echolocation. They send ultrasound. It strikes the prey, comes back, and that's how they visualize around them, right? Hana? Yes, sir. It's okay. It's okay. Not a problem. Uh, it's a question thing. Yeah. Very good. So, it's all right. This question, nobody got the point, but I like how we both approached. Huh? Very good. You were <laughs> almost there. Nice. But the wavelength is the length of one wave. Okay. Huh? Uh -huh. All right. Fine. So, this was the first visual. Let's have the second question. Now. Yes. Huh? So, now let's have the second visual on the screen. Yes. Ultrasonic is also same thing. It's ultrasound. Same question. Okay. So, Hansik, this is for you. Keep observing what is happening, right? Okay, have you all seen the visual? Yes. Yes? Alright, so let's come back and after that, let's have the question that is going to be based on the visual. Alright, so can we have the question please? Yes, which part of the body is the process that you saw mi is mimicking it so what is it mimicking which part of the body so you saw a video and there was a process that was happening what is it mimicking which part of the body is it mimicking yes your time starts now now yes so think about what you are able to see what did you see yeah yeah, I know the process, but what is mimicking? As in, what is it trying to do? It's There's a part of our body which does the same thing, right? Oh. So, which is the part of the body that does the same thing as what it is doing? So, can you tell me what all you see in that, in the video? I have no idea. Okay, alright. So, Gagana, do you want to take a try on this? Uh, I think it's hard. Okay, Gagana says hard. So close enough, Gagana, but actually I do understand there was a pump and maybe that's what made you believe it was the heart. But actually, this is mimicking the kidneys. So we've learned about dialysis, right? Wherein yes. sometimes when the kidney does not function properly, what does the kidney do? It actually filters out the blood, right? And all the toxic material that is there. But when it does not move properly or when it does not work properly, we do dialysis. So okay. what does the dial dialysis machine do? Replicate the kidney. Huh. Not a problem, not a problem. So at the end of round three, it's okay. Both of you had some, you know, hurdles, I would yes, say. Sir. But nonetheless, I think okay. you've done that's, a wonderful that's job. Is, right? Yes. <laughs> All right. And guys, chat will move fast. Right? You guys are also answering. It's supposed to move fast. If it's slow, then it's a problem. Take a chiba, right? Chat move fast or take Very good. So let's have the scoreboard after round three. All right. Very good. So I think this is again a tie. Nice. Yes. <laughs> 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 but now I'm fine. Now I feel relaxed. Na? That's Thoda what you and I thought <laughs> when the question came to Yes, I know. <laughs> it's okay, but at the end of the day, like how Hansik said, it's always a learning moment that we look for. And I think with every session that we do, especially when it's quizzes, we tell you, right? It's all about learning. Yes. And thank you so much, everyone, for the love that you're showing in the chat, for all the answers that you are sending. The chat is moving crazy and they're yes. giving me answers. And good answers, by the way. Very good. Okay, so with this, we are done with three rounds and let's move on to round four, which is going to be the decode round. Ooh, decode. Okay, so when I tell decode, huh. what is coming to your mind? Something hidden in the, like the, whatever the question you give, we have to de decode it. Okay. Yeah, that's true. 
But the words are, are the words are deco decoded in the same manner. Oh, nice. Oh, Guys, what do you words. think? And hey, by the way, we have what? 200 plus live watching, 120 like, kya kar rahe yaar? Aise thodi hota. Come on guys, like it right now. Your friends are playing so well. They are trying so hard and yes, you are also playing really well. Come on, like it right now. And uh, Because that's how you will show them your love, right? How else will they receive your love if you don't like this video? So do not forget to like, do not forget to subscribe to the channel. It is super important because sir, it happens only in Baiju's, right? <laughs> All this that you see will happen only in Baiju's. So if you do not subscribe, then of course, what is this? Who knows? Tomorrow you might be here, right? Yes. So, alright. And I think you, you guys are obviously very correct. Decode means the same thing. Right, ma'am? Yes. So we will have a set of images coming in front of you. So I'm just going to quickly tell you. So there will be like four images which will come and you will have to guess the technology, the science, whatever the question is asking you to guess okay so it's going to be very simple don't get too worried right yes. try to understand what the images are trying to show okay all right so can we have the first question on screen please yes so the question will be there on your screens for everybody in the chat as well yes all right so here we need to guess the common technology so gagna this is for you and you can have a look and just quickly try to figure out what all you are able to see on screen. Just list it out. The first <coughs> one is like pouring petrol. Okay. Mm -hmm. The second one is also something like that. Mm -hmm. The third one I can't understand what it is. It's written diesel over there. Oh yeah. Yeah. And last May it's written propane. Alright, so you saw the four pictures? Yes sir. Yeah. So now we'll give you 30 seconds and try to guess what technology that is coming. You're on the right track. Let, 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 you know, we'll tell you that. You're on the right track for sure. Uh, it's fossil fuels. Very good. How do we get, you know, all of you tell me I leak answers. So I'm being very careful. <laughs> <laughs> You saw four images, right? You said petrol, something, diesel, propane, right? So these are the pictures and what is the common technology? How do we get all of this? By, uh, by mining or something. Okay. Yes, technology behind their production. Ooh. All right. This was a slightly tough one. I, yeah. I, I give you that. Yes. Yeah, it was a tough one. Hansik, do you want to take a guess? Yes, ma'am, it is mining. Mining. Okay. So now I would say, see, both of you are not wrong, right? Because you get what you get the crude oil that is there from drilling. Yes. But here, if you see, sir, pointed out, there's diesel, there's petrol, right? So you are getting individual things. So how do we get that? We get that by fractional distillation, right? So the correct answer here is fractional distillation of petroleum. I know this was a tough one. This was yes. a slightly difficult one, but we will give it to you that the attempt that you made was amazing, right? So this would, would not have been easy. Yeah, this was a little difficult only. Yes, you're right. Drilling and then petroleum, fractional distillation, different boiling points. You get different, different things in different, yes, different columns. It gets separated. Yes. yes. It's okay. Not. It's, it's it's actually good. And guys, very good. Nice. You knew the answer, right? All right. All right. What do you say? Shall we next question? Yes. Next question. Course. Let's have the next question. Okay. Hansik, look at all the four images. <coughs> huh, you can see it there also. What do you see? And guys, you can also answer. Come on, what do you see? Last time you, you also struggled a little bit. Come on. Yes, Hansi, what do you see? The first image. You can just okay. list out it's what like you are able to uh, see. Some junkyard, scrapyard kind of thing, no? Yeah, they're just uh, separating it. Okay, second one, what do you see? Headphones. All right. So you saw all the four images, no? Yes. So the question is, guess the common device. 
Okay. Shall I start the timer? Yes. All right. Let's start the timer. So, a common device connecting all these four images. And yes, you guys come on. You keep answering. You can't stop. Some answers are coming in the chat, and we are of course and mixing it. Okay, electricity. So, common device. Electromagnet. Yes! Electromagnet is the right answer. Sir, I know the answer. I know. <laughs> it's okay. Thoda sana. Luck also matters a little bit. Yours was slightly difficult. So, yes, electromagnet. Because it was a scrap yard. So, you can separate all the metal waste, no? Using electromagnet. Guys, you know about this. Earphones, headphones, they also have electromagnets, right? Mobile phones, speakers. So yes, that is the common device. It is electromagnet. We use electricity and make a magnet. It's a temporary magnet, yeah. right? It's a very strong but temporary magnet. Yes. All right. So this was, I know, like not thoda sa bad luck, but yes, you got the point for electromagnet. Thanks. So let's have the scorecard, please. So now Hansik is at three points while Gagna is at two points. No problem, Gagna. We still have two more rounds. We have round five and round six, guys. So how's the joke? How's the excitement? Are we enjoying it, right? Yes. It's a lot of yes, interesting questions, yes, no? Shagunda, bilkul. Aap aa sakte ho. Hai na? Jab mera number aayega, hum tab studio mein aa jayenge. It depends on luck also. See, Gagna had a slightly bad luck. She got a difficult question. No, it thoda sa luck kaam karta hai na? It's okay, it's okay. All right. Shall we move to the next round? Yes, sir. Hai na? Yes. Round five. And this one is also kind of interesting. Hai na? Chalo. Round five is called as art and artist. But hey, ma'am, it's a science question. You know? What is art and artist? We have here, so we have Gagna here, we have Hansik here who love art as well. So what do you guys think? Actually, you tell us. What do you think art and artist could be? It's something, something about the... Picture. Like, uh, drawing, I mean pictures. Okay, yes. Maybe something to do with pictures. Maybe in science also, no? Lot of things happen. We uh, diagrams. diagrams. Oh, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> this sounds so funny. They're like, mom, diagrams. <laughs> no, no. So here, art and artist is our twist into science and scientist, right? So we have a we know about a lot of scientists who have had so many important contributions in science, yes. right? And we are going to be learning. Yes, Samyukta, inventors and inventions. Very good. Yes. So that's what we're going to be discussing, right, sir? So they are what? They are inventors that's the artist the inventions is the art basically so yes. it's like art and artist is like science and scientist uh -huh. all right so we'll give you a part of the story and you have to guess who the scientist is all right fine come on we'll rock this one huh? yes sir. yes very good chalo let's have the question on screen So, let me read it carefully, Anna. you can also read it. A man with poor hearing created the phonograph, the first device that could record and replay the sound. <coughs> he suggested using the word hello as a telephone greeting. He is most renowned for inventing the electric light bulb. Identify the scientist. I know the answer. It's okay. Do you want me to start a timer or you know the answer? I know the answer, sir. Alright, so guys, Gagna knows the answer. What about you? You tell us in the comment section. So before Gagna tells us, you tell us and let's see if we are all on the same page, right? Do we know who this art is? I mean, artist is. Very good, correct answers coming in the chat. Nice, Gagna. Your friends also know the answer for this. Alright, so let me ask you something before you give the answer. What was the biggest clue for you? The electric bulb. Yeah, no? <laughs> nice. Very good. So, all right, you can tell us the answer. Thomas Alva Edison. Whoa, brilliant. That's the correct answer. Very good. Thomas Alva Edison. You're right. He's most renowned for electric, commercial production of electric light bulb. Right? And yes, he also invented phonograph. Yes. Ah, uh, phonograph and gramophone, these are two different things, guys, okay? So, phonograph was an earlier version. So, that is in the name of Thomas Elva Edison, okay? Okay? And I don't be confused with this. All right. 
So, feeling good now? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Very good. After two rounds, now I'm like, yes, got my groove back, right, Dagna? Nice. Okay. So, Hansek, are yeah. we ready for yours? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So, can we have the question on screen, please? Okay, so the question is on screen and I will read it out for you as well. Once there was a scientist who was eager to study bacteria and thus culture it in a petri dish. The scientist was forgetful and he left the petri dish open near a window and suddenly it became contaminated with an other organism that killed the bacteria. This led to a major discovery in the field of biology which is even used today. Identify the scientist. Hansik, do we know the answer? Yes, ma'am. Do we need the timer? Yes, ma'am. No. no need, right? No. Okay. So before Hansik reveals his answer, everybody in the chat, do we know who this scientist is who was forgetful and left his, uh, you know, bacterial culture and he came back later only to see that the other organism was growing on it? Are we getting the answers in the chat? Nice story, yeah. It's a nice, very nice story. Yes. All right. So we can see that a lot of answers are coming in. So, Hansik, do you want to tell? Yes, ma'am. Okay. It's Alexander Fleming. Alexander Fleming. Answers coming in the chat. And are we getting a lot of correct answers? Yes. All right. Very good, Hansik. That is the correct answer. It is Alexander Fleming, right? And what did he discover? What is he known for? Antibodies. Anti antibodies or antibiotics? Antibiotics. Yes, it is antibiotics, right? So the organism that was growing that was there was nothing but Penicillium notatum. And from there he discovered the first antibiotic that was penicillin. Yes. Yes, right. Pradipa, we are telling you the score. Let's have the scoreboard now. Ooh. So we nice. have Dagana at three points and we have Hansek at four points. All right. So we are done with five rounds. And we yes. told you the last round is a Surprising. surprise. So now that we all are warmed and pumped up, this round you will enjoy a lot because this round is called as ma'am. The rapid fire round. So round six here is going to be the rapid fire round. Yes. So now everyone and of course for Gagana and Hansik, we'll quickly be telling you what are the rules of the rapid fire. So sir, would you like to tell them? Yes. So in front of you, you have buzzers, right? Okay. So we'll ask a question and very quickly. So rapid fire means first. speed, right? Speed and accuracy. So whoever press the buzzer first, they will get a chance to answer. All right. Okay. That Fine. means both of you have equal opportunities to answer the same number of questions. And okay. questions are going to be simple, but this is going to be all about how fast you are. So are we ready? Shall yes, we be sir. ready with the buzzer? Yes, right? Quick and ready to go. Yes, sir. So we are going to have a total of 10 questions. First five Saurabh sir will be asking. Next five I will be asking you. All right. So these questions are for <coughs> both of you. Okay. Ready? Yes, sir. Pakka? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. First question for you. Which planet has the largest moon in the solar system? Yes, Gagana. Yes, Gagana. It's Jupiter. Correct answer. Very good. Question number two. Which component of food is called the instant energy provider? Gagana. Carbohydrates. Ooh. Correct. Third question. Which instrument is used to measure atmospheric pressure? It's the uh, barometer. Barometer. Yes. Very good. I'll give it to you. <laughs> yes, you're right. Question number four. What is the full form of DNA? This is slightly tricky one. I'm sorry. It's that okay. Take it's it. okay. I'll, I'll give you five more seconds. Five, four, three. No, sir. It's okay. Do you want to take this? All right. It's deoxyribose nucleic acid. Yes, sir. <laughs> All right. Fifth question. Who is known as the missile man of India? APJ Abdul Kalam. Yes. It's Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam. Very good. So oh, five okay. questions done. Very good, guys. Come on, come on. Yes. Come yes. Up. So can we have the scoreboard, please, after the first five questions in rapid fire? Oh, now we have Gagna at 
six points and we have Hansik at five points. Now this is going very nice. competition, no? It's like a turn of events. <laughs> yeah. All right, come on, come on. Very good. We have five more questions, right? Nah? Oh, okay, all right. So now the next question is, which is the heaviest organ in the body? Heaviest. Organ. Organ. Which which do you think is very heavy in the body? Heaviest organ. Take a guess. It's okay. Yeah, yeah. It's the heart. Okay. It's actually not the heart. Gagana, do you want to take a guess? Yes, ma'am. Small intestine. Okay. No, act no, that's actually incorrect. It's actually liver, right? It's the heaviest that is there. Okay. It's okay. No problem. No problem. Now, moving on. What are the animals that eat only plants? I'm hard viewers. Okay, I've, I've thought it came from there. Well done, well done. Okay, next one. Which element is liquid at room temperature? Yes. Me. Okay. No, no, it came from there. Oh, Mercury. I have to keep. Mercury. Very good, very, very good. good. Okay. Which type of motion is exhibited by the pendulum? Yes, Kakana. Oscillatory. Yes, very good. Nice. And last question. So actually before the last question, can we have the score on, on screen please? It's seven Whoa, all. Nice. It is seven all. So it's a tiebreaker question. Okay. All okay. right. Are we ready? Duck, duck. Duck, duck. Oh, <laughs> nice. Okay, now this is going to be all about speed guys. So be ready. Which force pulls us towards the earth? Gravitational. Gravitational. Oh. oh. <laughs> Gagna's buzzer was first. Okay. Oh, all right. Well done, Gagna. So well done. Gagna was slightly faster with okay. the buzzer, but you also knew the answer. Yes. So in true spirit, both of you are winners, but well done, Gagna. Well done. Well done. But I'll tell you, this last round was like a match. Yes. Like, yeah. Oh my God, we're going to win, lose, win, lose. So much excitement was there, no? <laughs> Yes, all right. So with this, if you see, we have the final scores. Can we just have it once again on screen, please? And everybody, send your love. Well done, Gagna. Eight points. Whoa, ho. and well done, guys, both of you. Yes, yes. well you done, have Hansik. You brilliantly. You are not. You're just right behind her with seven <laughs> points, right? So this was amazingly done. And did you all enjoy it today? How was yes, this ma'am. edition of Quiz Masters? It was awesome, really. Some right. sixth sense was going in my mind that like, Tai will come. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, how did you enjoy it, right? I, I know you have enjoyed it also. Hana? Mazaya? Jaldi batao. Come on. Yes. See. We all love these kind of sessions, right? But we also love to speak in English. As a hota hai. See, a lot of times it happens, no, that we all feel so underconfident care. We can't go in front of people and talk in English. Kya bolenge, kaise bolenge, aise karenge, aise karenge. And that's why this small course becomes really important, right? This is the Baiju Spoken English course. And you can avail it for the price of 999. It's a two month course. Cambridge certified teachers are there. And it's specially to improve your confidence in spoken English, right? Spoken and written English. So I would say, go ahead, try it out. It's there in the description. Right, ma'am? Yes, of course. And as you know, it's available from grades four to nine now, right? So earlier, if you see, we would tell you it was there for eight to nine, but now it's available from four to nine. So please do check it out. Link is there in the description box. And now, of course, before signing off, right? Now, very quickly, everybody, let us know how you felt about this edition. Like how Gagna and Hunter Sick, were supremely excited, right? And they saw this. You are seeing this beautiful set, you are seeing amazing effects, and it's all because of the team. But if you see, sir, in reality, right? Should we tell them in reality how it is actually? But you know what, ma'am? I think you guys, you they have we have a homework for them, no? Yeah. A small homework for you. That's tell us in the comment section what is your favorite round, okay? All right, so people, I would say, 
Oh, nice. I was just thinking. No, that's at the end. Okay. <laughs> okay. I was, I was thinking if you have any surprise. Sir, I was really thinking like he would win the da- he would win the quiz. I know. You know, Gagna told us in the starting. I'm from class six. He's from class eight. Yes. It's, it's not a it's not a valid competition. <laughs> but nice guys, you played really well. Yeah. And yes, I know you also enjoyed. Make sure to press the like button to subscribe and don't forget to register for the webinar. Okay. It's very important. We have two channels and we have webinar coming on fourth of December. And you also, how many of you want to be in the quiz master? Come on, let's. let's I'm sure a lot of them would want to be in the quiz master. Kid, I want to come. Tell me, quickly. How many people want to share the stage here? A right. lot of them would be like, sir, if I was a student, I would want to be there and take part in this quiz, right? Huh? So everybody, we know how much you love quiz masters, right? Which is why, sir, why don't we tell them? Ninety-nine percent of you are saying, I know. I don't know where this one percent. Ah, where are the one percent? Wale. Jan May, we are having it again. Yes, okay. It'll happen in Jan again. You can register from today itself. The form is given to you in the description. Please do it. Yes, January 2023. Okay, so do not forget to register. The dates will be announced very soon. We'll keep you updated on our channel. And if you want more updates on this, you know what you should do. No, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Yes. Okay. So now, of course, everyone. It's before we sign off, sir. I think we shall reveal, right? Yes, we have goodies for you guys. Yes, please join us at the center. Come, 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 come in, come, come. Woohoo! Woo-hoo! These are the goodies, huh? Dagnan, this is for you. A small gift from us. for being an amazing contestant joining us on stage and we love you bachcha very good thank you sir and hansik this is for you thank for you. bringing in all that joy and being so cheerful thank and you. for bringing your excitement right yes, so it's all of you that make us do what we want to do every day so well played lots of love to you yes, yes. last year come on woohoo